Greetings everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel, Alex here and of course we are going to Sydney tonight. So many Sydney flights, I wonder why do they not send me to Melbourne every once in a while? <laughs> But uh, yeah, let's get ready for the Sydney flight. I'm just doing my luggage now. I've written my flight details and I'm ready to go. Now it's a bit of a mess in my room. I didn't actually even vacuum, so I apologize for that in advance. I'm just getting my luggage ready right here, ladies and gents. I have um, some trousers, some sneakers, a few here and there items. I didn't put much because it will be quite warm in Sydney. So if in case I'm going out, it'll be okay, it'll be chill, it'll be nice. I don't have to pack warm clothes. It's not that proper winter, Australian winter yet. And uh, here I have my small luggage, just my pyjamas for the in-flight rest. I have my shirt. I have another shirt below. Below everything there is a pouch with another shirt that's properly ironed. And here there's my cables for my laptop. I'll put my laptop on top of this. So basically I'll have everything needed in my small luggage and everything extra for the layover in my big luggage. All right, all right, ladies and gents, I prepared myself. I am ready. I am ready for the Sydney flight. It's gonna be a night flight. It's gonna be a long flight, but uh, it's gonna be my rest time. So I assume I will have a nice sleep during the in-flight rest, I'm looking forward to that. It's gonna be my first ultra long haul experience in business class because I had one more Sydney, it was in economy the previous month. Now I'm fully business class crew, so yeah, gonna be interesting. Let us go, ladies and gents, let us go for the flight. Guys, so we are in Sydney now. I am in my humble hotel room. This is not one of the best hotel rooms that we have. You know, it does the trick. It, it has a comfortable bed, I can tell you that. It was a night flight, it was a long flight. We actually had a bit of a delay because on the ground in Abu Dhabi, we had a sick passenger that had to be offloaded. Also, the bags had to be offloaded. So basically, it was, it was a bit of a delay because of that. And that's normal, that's something that happens in aviation often. Basically do it for their own safety and uh, they will catch the next flight once they are okay. But yeah, long flight for me and for the crew as well. It was a long duty and now I'm so jet lagged, I don't know what to do. It's basically 3 p.m. 3 p.m. in Abu Dhabi time, but here is night time in, uh, in Sydney. So I don't know if I should sleep right now, if I should watch a movie and have something to eat and later on sleep. I don't know what to do and this is my normal state of being in one of those layovers, ladies and gents. This is how we roll. Now this is my hotel room, this is the entrance, this right here is the bathroom. Let me just put the click. Alrighty, ladies and gents, this is the sink area. We have a bathtub right here. Everything is clean and nice and of course the amenities the amenities are right here ladies and gents along with the hair dryer which is a bit small um, and towels and so on and so forth I think I actually presented this hotel room on a different occasion yes I did we do have a mini bar in which we have just milk for the coffee that we might have right here ladies and gents oh yes Coffee, always a good idea, right? Especially when jet lagged in a layover. Anyway, this is the bed. As you can see, it's quite large. It is fluffy, 
indeed yes i also have a tv here and the wires are out for some reason that's bad cable management right here now that we have this quick introduction of my hotel room i will indeed go have a shower probably order something to eat and then slowly fade away fade away into my sleeping mood ladies and gents thank you very much for watching my youtube channel hope this video was entertaining for you don't forget to leave a like subscribe to my youtube channel if you're not subscribed yet you know the drill ladies and gents bye bye see you on the next one